Well, one thing I think Wu-Tang tried to do was tell our story to the world, tell our experiences. You know, growing up um, in New York during the um, 90s, now that the dust is cleared for the Grammy Awards, we can focus on some pre-Grammy events, one of which was the BMI How I Wrote That Song panel. The event held by the BMI songwriting organization the day before the Grammys spotlights the best singers and songwriters of today and has them tell the stories of how some of the biggest hits came together. Highlights in past years included song stories from songwriter and former American Idol judge Cara Diaguardi, Will I Am and T-Pain working with Chris Brown, and CeeLo Green, who co-wrote Fuck You. This year's panel featured Benji and Joel Madden of Good Charlotte, DJ Khaled, RZA, Rev Run, and Red One. During the panel, Red One discussed how he met Lady Gaga. So he told me, okay, I want you to meet this girl. This girl, she's, uh, uh, I was like, okay, she signed. He was like, no, she just got dropped. I was like, oh my God, I'm, this is my chance in life, please. And then he was like, just meet her five minutes. If you don't like her, you don't have, she's a good songwriter at least, so just meet her. I went to the CD, I was like, hey, red one. She's like, hey, Lady Gaga, with the sang sunglasses and this attitude. I was like, okay. We sat down, <laughs> you know, this uh, Lady Gaga kind of thing, you know? <laughs> so it was fun to talk to her and then we were talking music. And she knows a lot about music and, and same for me. DJ Khaled, who had a number one single, I'm On One, featuring Drake, Rick Ross, and Lil Wayne, talked about why songwriters are important. Um, songwriters are important because um, a good written song and a well-produced song and a well-orchestrated record uh, turns out to be a number one. Everybody wants a number one, and everybody wants a great record. And um, with the right people, you can make some timeless records with the right team. Joel Madden of Good Charlotte said he was looking forward to the How I Wrote That Song panel. I'm really excited. Uh, it's, it's a huge honor to be here with, uh, with these other guys, with uh, artists that I look up to and that I've been a fan of. Um, not only past, present, and I'm sure future. Uh, but it, it's cool for me because as a songwriter and as an artist, I can never be around it enough. So I, I soak it up just as much as anyone watching the panel or asking the questions, uh, I'm learning just as much as they are, I'm sure. BMI, a global leader in rights management, is an American performing rights organization that represents more than 500,000 songwriters, composers, and music publishers in all genres of music and more than 7.5 million musical works. The company provides licenses for businesses that perform music and distributes the fees it generates as royalties to the musical creators and copyright owners it represents. So it wasn't like, okay, we're going to make a record and we hope Adidas gives us a million dollars and get our own pair of, you know, line of Adidas clothing. So it wasn't, that wasn't the focus. The focus was to make a, a record that represented us and a record that um, was dope.